that's kind of interesting. Now, we're filing. It's dull. It's never had a file. There's something wrong with the clutch on this one too. I don't know if I have anything for it, but I can rob one from another saw, no problem. It makes a squeak, this thing. And if you don't have control of your mind. I haven't been into this saw yet. So what this saw is, friends, this is, um, well, we do have something we can cut. Okay, so what this saw is, I haven't been into it yet. Let's go into it. I don't even know what it's got for a carb. I don't know if it's a, uh, a governed carb or not. I'm not sure, friends. But all I do know is that I fell some timber for it. Traded, Larry. <laughs> Gosh, it looks clean in here, friends. <laughs> I mean, seriously clean. Doesn't look like it's been run in a long time. I don't think... These... These are legendary, okay? They're legendary. My wife this morning, she made like a... Gosh, I don't know what it was. But it was good another factor that prompted that though what was it again babe <laughs> we love doing things for one another we always have okay we uh we got a big thumbs up on this one friends you you almost need to come in here and look at this it's not a governed carburetor you know what that means don't you it's a thumbs up on this one okay no, it's it's not a governed carb. The twenty. This is this is this is one of the best saws out there in this genre, in my opinion. It's a twenty one hundred. Is basically what it is, friends. Look at this. It's been rebuilt by the same guy that rebuilt a couple of mine. Husqvarna twenty one oh one W. I don't know what the W means. I just don't know. But what I'm gonna tell you. It's got a stock muffler on it. The, 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 the plastics are pretty much all good. There's a break in this one here. The tank is good. It don't leak. The pole starts great. But look, friends, look at this. Oh, my. Oh. 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 So... Friends, uh, I'm kind of excited to run this one. So, uh, you, 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 you're coming down. You're coming down to look at this, friends. Okay? Come on down. L look at what we've got. Look at how long this bar is. Look at it. <laughs> it's probably 36 is what it is. It's a 36 inch bar. Let's be honest. It's 36 from here, right? So, so it's a 36, but the bar itself is, is longer than that. Now, how, but look in here, look at this. No governed carburetor, doesn't have the, the, the screw on it, right? Th this thing is gonna rip, roar, and scream. <laughs> Must be an old vent or something right there. It goes down into the tank. Look at this saw. 2101. 
It's beautiful. It's beautiful. So, This is the first filing. This chain has not been filed. See, there's the factory grind right there. You can still see it. It's in, it's, there it is. There's the factory grind. You see that little mark right there? Yeah, that's factory. That's not factory. Okay. See? Factory. Not factory. So if you want to see the other side, how it comes through the other side, I'll show you that now. Yes. Right there. Okay. Which is this guy. Okay. You'll probably see my hand. Actually, no. This is going to work absolutely crazily. Watch what happens. Remember, this is the first filing, friends. So you can do all kinds of things. You can come down at it like this if you want. I, I do the boat stroke depending on how badly it's rocked. This is the first filing and is not rocked terribly. It's not. It's just been scalded up a bit. So I'm just maintaining gullet, pushing down and in. It's nowhere near where I want it yet. There, now I'm underneath the top plate. You'll notice a burr if the camera's set right. I don't care about how many strokes. It's about getting the tooth filed. Now, if there's too much hook, friends, if there's too much hook, you're gonna, your top tooth is gonna, is gonna bend over. Look at that. They've just, they've pulled way too much gullet. That, that's very aggressive. It's too aggressive in my mind because your top plate, even if you don't hit something, your top plate takes a thrashing, friends, when you when you hog gullet like that. That's too much about. You don't need that much. I'll show you what you need. Let's take a look. See, there's the burr right there. There it is. Can you guys see that? It's right there. I hope you can see that in the camera. I'm not sure if you can, but let's just get rid of it. And how we get rid of the burr is we just sit up on the file a little bit. There it is. There's Mr. Burr. Let's see if you guys can grab that on camera. There it is. But you see the hook? You see you see what's happening here? Yeah. Let's get this. Let's get it so we can get on to the next one here. So remember a lot of this filing that just went on 
was gullet filing. Isn't that nice? Yeah. And not only that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That. And that. Okay. Remember, for, this is the first filing. This is gonna. This is gonna be fun. Okay, I'll turn this off. And we'll get back to you. Okay, friends. So this is uh, raker time. I've just finished filing the saw. It took me about oh gosh, I don't know, half an hour, forty minutes. And now it's time for these two tools, the raker. Somebody asked me a strange question in the last video where I had the half ground and the half, like half ground chain and the half round file chain. I did that for a, an experiment. Everything I do is experiment. Um, and to answer questions, someone asked me, did you use the, the same, or are, are, the, are the rakers the same size on, on, on each side. Well, friends, I, I didn't understand. I don't know who answered the question, but it, it, that's what raker gauges do. That, that's what they are. It didn't matter if you had 15 power saws lined up. That This is the gauge. They'll all be set at that. Every tooth will be set at that gauge. I don't care if this tooth here is, is half the size. You see? This goes like this. This one here, same way, it's the other side. It's the same deal. Here's the other side. Here's the left side, right? That's it, here's the right side, okay? So we, we come here, here's the right side, okay? Here's the left side. That, that's how they're designed, friends. <laughs> I, I didn't understand the question. It, it asked if it's, if it's the same. I guess I, I don't know, I'm not sure. But this is how a raker gauge works. If you're filing your rakers, you hear that, you hear that weird squeaking noise? Friends, just turn your freaking, just turn your freaking, just turn your freaking, just turn it over to the 45. Just go like this. Oh, I, I don't, I don't get all this crazy stuff I'm hearing about. I don't know. I, May, I, may, I don't know. This is going to be hungry. I do know that, though. So the right side was worse than the left side. Okay. There we go. There we go. Left. Right. Left. Right. Left. Oh, look at that. There's one of those, there's one of those crazy ones, friends. You hear that? Check it out. Oh yeah, there's one. Look. Oh, we got lucky. Good. Once in a while, you'll get like a steel raker, a hardened raker or a hardened tooth. Has that ever happened to you? That's it. It's done. This thing is done and ready to go. Look at it. So friends, this is kind of funny. Uh, this is what I, I started my fallen career on is 36 inch uh, with my 394 when I went to camp. And uh, the 21, the 394 took over from the, from the 2100. It just did. Uh, I remember the claw talking about it. He says he'd put that, you know, he put the 21 down and, and it was, you know, into the 394. 
So I do have a couple things I can cut down here. It's not it's not glorious, but we we're in the process of cleaning up this mess. Remember, friends, we had the the balsam there and that, so it's in a precarious spot. But we're getting uh, we're getting a few miles on our our hop skippity boots here. And uh, are they ever comfortable? These things. So, <clears throat> friends, I, I just here it is. This is the saw that Larry gave me. Uh, it's the one that, that he paid me uh, for. I didn't really want, I wasn't going to charge Larry for that last job. It was just too fun. He said, you know, he, let's get you something. <laughs> and, uh, and he gave me that. And it, it's the 2101 friends is actually, in my opinion, a better saw than the 2100. Uh, reason being, there's no governed carburetor on this saw. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, I I, I like this little saw. I, I like this little area I'm standing in right now, actually, too, to be honest with you. But I'm going to stand up and buck a couple little cuts here with this thing. The clutch is making a racket. It's doing a squeak. That means it, it's, it was perhaps maybe used for milling. I don't know. But I, I'm going to just show you. We hand filed this. Just did the rakers. So this is how it, it, it'll be a little hungry because it's full house, right? It's full house chain and it's probably at about 30 degrees. So this can, this, this is going to be a hungry chain. Just telling you right now, but it's a 2100. So we shouldn't really have an issue. You know what I'm saying? We just shouldn't. It, it should fire quite nicely. See this bark? If you, if you got loose debris on, on logs, it'll catch you right in the face. Choke it. Listen to this thing. You hear that? So, friends, this thing is absolutely beautiful. I, I'm. These were lovely saw. Now, oh, and they had their day in the bush. These things. I'm telling you, they're lovely. Anyways, friends, this thing is really fat. This is my first run. It is so fat. Um, it doesn't have a governed carb, which is that brass screw in there. You know what I mean? It doesn't have that. But I, I do a little bit of piddle around here find out how fat it is I cut with it and I do tune it and I get it singing but I'm not gonna bore you with the details and all that a little bit I will but I'm telling you something right now this thing's beautiful and the clutch noise goes away it was just so dry
Okay, friends, listen to what I do here. Listen to the power saw, to the four stroking, and then listen to it rev up. I gotta, I gotta be quite honest with you. Um, listen to it. Gosh, they have a beautiful sound. It's just, it's just like a. Listen to that. It's, it's hard to explain. But strong sound. Thanks for watching. Happy Sunday evening. Get yourself some good food. Sit down with your family. Give everybody hugs. Tell them you love them dearly. Just be kind to one another, friends. And we'll catch you on the next video. Over and out. Thumbs up. Thank you.